Taba menyaka jenu maluku a palamente huzwa mikhen e fa paning e tsuitsi peli hunga nyisana kapuya se chaba e aduwe nkimo president wa na hailing siro ramaposa kalabunela wiki e fitileng. Za tsing la maubane ramaposa unia libane libo hali huzwa mikhen ya se politiki. Mubu ngata abune mbupaka huso khoso fazu kete ya matzai pa minza busini kloke ho ya misebe zile hukloka busitu hawa muruo wa naha. Pumanso e mwenyebe ya matlo isi danari tuto e nye klendikolo tse makishin ingle mahayeng. Tinswalo voted for you. Like many others across the country, she did so for one reason. Because she believed that you, Mr. President, would restore South Africa to the path it was on when she was a child. That you would rescue the South African dream. But tragically, her hopes were shattered soon after. In the same year that Mr. Ramaphosa was elected, Tinswalo lost the first and only job she had because the load-shedding crisis that he had promised to end shut down the factory where she worked. The ANC and the ANC alone gave us state capture. They gave us load-shedding stage six. The ANC gave us nine wasted years. The ANC gave us close to 8 million unemployed people of South Africa. Let us not pull wool over our people's eyes and pretend that the ANC is the only party that can protect South Africa and do what is best for her. The ANC only save ANC. Honorable President, my generation did not get any solution in the sauna you delivered. As a result, unlike Tim Swallow, the people of South Africa and our youth are dissolutioned by the ANC for they have lived through the destruction of our country at the hands of the ANC government. Therefore, 2024 is our 1994. We will do what we did in 1994. We will remove the government that has failed our people. Order, Honorable. The ANC destroyed ESCO. You were in charge of the war room to end load shedding. You failed. When you became president in 2018, the local currency against the dollar was nothing else than 11 rand 55. Yesterday, it was 18 rand 92. That's under your leadership. If you go and look at the unemployment rate, when you became the president, the unemployment rate was 24%. It is now 32%. Ya bona nina ingake yenu into bana nikhathale lingxake zamanyamazwe nihlohlulwa zingxake zalapha ekhaya nihoyele namanyamazwe ningakwazi unika abantu wena bethi imfundo esemgangathweni kwaye odjad wethu kunyanzele ke belele namaqabane kuze bafumane imisebenzi noba sele befundile nithanda ningathandi anibuye